Welcome back to the Style Dome. I'm so excited. Are you excited? I'm excited. Okay, first of all, look how cute this is. I'm in love with it. It's precious and it has like a little um thing in the bottom. I'm not good at explaining things. Anyways, I am so excited to be back. Thank you guys for still following up. I know it's been a while, but I am super excited to be making videos again. First of all, um, super weird thing. I put on makeup today. <laughs> Everyone be proud. I never do that. But I put on like a good amount for this video to make sure I like looked okay. And look, like I've never like been good at makeup, but I feel like it was okay. And I have like a little bit of like shimmery proud of myself okay so the reason we are here today is I want to talk to you about the hottest trends this summer and I know summer's halfway over but I can guarantee you these are gonna go into the fall so this is gonna hopefully help you out so let's get started first like super big trend is chokers and I'm wearing one right now but I have like 800 billion and it's a really big problem I think I'm hoarding them I love chokers so much and they are so in style right now especially like layering a bunch of them I know there are a lot of different brands let me try to think I know Raw Rebellious sells a lot of super cute like the beaded chokers that you can put together and then Georgia Jewelry I think is one of them I don't know but there are a lot of different places you can literally get chokers anywhere and you probably already know that but that's just something that's definitely going to go into the fall season and I want you guys to make sure that we got that covered. Yes? Perfect. Second thing, speaking of my choker, is embroidery. Embroidered, like, things, I think when you hear that word you kind of think of, like, your little baby clothes that you wore that have, like, the little smock dresses and the embroidery on them. No. Like, they're so popular now. Like, my choker is something I have that's embroidered and I love it so much. This is a skirt that I just got from Lizard Thicket, a boutique in... Birmingham, Columbus, and Noonan, and probably somewhere else, but those are the only three that I know about, but I love it so much, and that's just like goes to say that embroidery is like a huge thing, and I have an embroidered denim jacket with like a little rose on it, and like I have this jacket from Anthropology that's like this denim type, but it's like a shirt material, and it has all these different like embroidered and embellishments like all over it, and that's just like a super big thing right now, especially like with jeans and skirts and cutoffs and Literally everything you can get is embroidered, so I love it a lot. Okay, the next one is platforms. That's like the strangest thing I've ever heard shoes called, but they're actually super popular, and you can Google it. Like, that's what they're called. I'm not crazy. It's a real word, but they call them platforms. So this is like, I'll show you this one first. These are like my absolute favorites, and they're kind of odd. Like, when you just look at them, they look kind of weird and like chunky. They remind me so much of the 70s, but I'm telling you everything comes back around but I love these so much I got them from Revolve maybe I think is where I got them and they make me taller and now it's acceptable for me to be taller like that so we're doing very good and I also have these which are like more wedge typed but they're kind of like OTBTs and they're really I don't know why I didn't lace this <laughs> it's not gonna happen these are super in style right now and they're the most comfortable shoes I've ever worn I think these are from I want to say TJ Maxx. I don't know. But I love them so much and they're so comfortable and incredible. 10 out of 10 recommend you to get those. Our next like big thing is bright patterns. Okay, first look at this. Look how cute. Look at this pattern. Does it not make you just like want to hula dance? It reminds me of Hawaii so much. And I love it. I love it. It's incredible. That brings us to our next topic, which is matching sets. I'm not a big fan of strapless, but that's also kind of coming in style. And I'm starting to like it a little bit more. I don't know. It's grown on me. But I definitely recommend finding a matching set, especially if you're in a college town and you have game day coming up. There are a lot of super cute ones that would be your team colors. So definitely check that out. A major one that I forgot in my nose. I'm ill. Like I'm sick. And I don't know how to describe it. I'm not sick. But my nose has just been like running for years. Literally. I think I'm eternally ill, but it's fine. It just will not stop running. So if I sniffle, I promise, like, it's not gross. It just, it's not a fan of me. This summer, white has totally, like, made a huge comeback. And I'm a fan of it. Because I know, like, the boho theme was in style for a super long time. And it's still kind of in style. But those were definitely more of, like, the neutral shades. Shh, quiet. And it's kind of coming back to, like, a cleaner look. It's kind of like the blogger style, I guess, is what you would call it. 
I don't know, but it's just like some of the brighter colors and the white, something that looks like super clean against like a white background, you know what I'm talking about? Look up like a blog website, literally any of them, you can look at mine, and it's just like a really clean feel. And I love it so much because it makes everything a whole lot easier and white goes with a lot. Like this top I have right here, I love it so much. And it cuts, I don't know if you can really, really see it, but it cuts right here. Oh, look at this. I'm wearing Nikes. I'm sorry. My video was only supposed to be here up, so like why would I put on pants? Sorry. I love this top so much and it's so comfortable and it goes with literally anything. So white is definitely coming around right now. I honestly think that's all I have. I'm in a link all the websites to where I got my different articles of clothing from. Mine is this choker. This is actually not a choker. It's a headband. Don't tell anyone. But it was literally just like one of those elastic in the back headbands and I wrapped it around and I bobby pinned it and now it's a choker. True story. That is one of my like secret little life hacks. I have a lot of those. I'll probably do a video on like my little strange life hacks that I do because that sounds stupid but I have a lot of them that help me so maybe they'll help you too so like if this video helped like if you want me to do that how-to video and please comment below if you have any questions any like statements any ideas of what you think I should do for other videos because I love seeing y'all's comments and I comment back every single time and it is incredible and I love you guys so much we are at 97 look at it 97 subscribers right now we are so close to 100 and I like promise you on my life that when we hit 100, I'm doing a giveaway. As long as you're subscribed to my channel, you have like a chance to win it. To... That was so much more difficult to say than I thought it was going to be. <sighs> Enter to win the giveaway. I'm real out of breath now. Definitely subscribe if you want to enter for that giveaway because as soon as we hit 100, we'll be doing a 100 video in this huge 100 giveaway and I am so thrilled to do that and have you guys be a part of it. Thank you so much for being a part of all of the fun stuff that I've done and just kind of supporting me through it because I know it's kind of an odd thing for me to do just personally. I feel kind of weird about it but with all of y'all's support, it's incredible, and I love it so much, so thank you, and I will see you guys soon. Goodbye from the Style Dome.